Today we're running a taster day that gives care experienced young people an opportunity to drop in, say hi to us and find out about the ICAM programme, uh, what they'll be doing in the ICAM programme, they'll be able to meet the team and find out a little bit more about how it can benefit them. But it allows opportunities that don't exist currently. We have a great deal of, of care experienced young people and adults who are really interested in careers in nursing, in physiotherapy, in a lot of the different careers that are out there in health and social care. I think it seems like doors are shut and we want to open them doors and actually say, yes, you might not have the qualifications you need right now, you might not have the experience you need right now, but we can help you get there. This session is designed to uh, provide a kind of a feeling of how the programme will run and what the, the learners can expect um, upon completion. What we are able to do is we're able to look at the education achievements that they've got today and we're able to then map what they would need to get to their desired career pathway. My name is Abigail Daniels and I'm here on behalf of the Royal Hospital for Neurodisability, a non-profit charity organisation based in Putney. We um, specialise in adults with long-term brain injury. So what we're going to be doing is providing Level 2 apprenticeships, which is a 12 to 18 month programme where they will come be fully employed by us through if they are successful in the recruitment drive and um, they'll complete the, the apprenticeship and that will give them the experience and the skills to be able to progress in their healthcare career. And the main aim of ICANN is to make sure that um, we provide a full overview of all opportunities available to care leavers and the support they can get to reach their full potential. Hopefully we'll have some really good outcomes and we'll be able to roll it forward and create a bigger programme and get more applicants through the door and, and help more young people. I think it's a really important initiative because it gives young um, adults the drive and hope to sort of enter a career that they might have otherwise thought was impossible and providing all the skills and support that they need to, to excel. We want education to be accessible to all and it's really important that we're leading with that and we're leading by example.